Welcome to the Media Bubble Podcast, the podcast that talks about movies, animes, comics, video games, and whatever we feel like. I'm your host, Frederick, and with me as always is my co-host, Carol. Carol. Yeah, right, we switched it up. I'm supposed to say that now. Sorry. <laughs> well, anyway, well, I... This time around, uh, Carol doesn't know what we're going to do in this episode because uh, I have a little bit of a um, quiz, if you can just... uh, Okay, so here's what we're going to do in this episode, Carol. Yeah, you haven't told me anything. I'm just, like, anticipating Mm. everything. Okay. As you may know, not the audience, but you may know this, I'm a pretty big uh, ice hockey fan. Yeah, we have talked about this before, actually. Yeah, and uh, I'm not going to talk talk to you about ice hockey per se, but I wanted to have kind of a episode where I can express some of my love for the sport. And... We're going to look at logos for the National Hockey Leagues. So you don't need to know anything about ice hockey, but I'm going to show you some logos for for these (laughs) National Hockey Leagues teams. And I made it kind of a game, a guessing game, where just with the the logo you have to um, guess the team name and the city where that team is located on. And you can get a total of maximum of four points, four for the if you get the city right, and no two if you get the city right, and two points if you get the the team name right. But if you don't get it, you can also choose to get a clue. Uh, and how many clues can, can you can, can I get have? a clue for every? Uh, uh, for every team, there's two clues. There's one clue for uh, um, uh, the, ci- the city or state name, or and there's one clue for um, the team name. Okay, and just for us listeners, like, Fredrik is into hockey. I've only, like, the most hockey I hockeyed was in school at like uh, or gym class and besides that like how i met your mother that's 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 where i get my yeah but you don't from. really need to know much about hockey in this case it's mostly um pretty i, I, I feel pretty like it's more a, a united say ge- geographical test than actually that's even worse. Yeah, so I have to, I had to make these clues as easy as I could. But just so you know, if you choose to get one clue, then the two points reduces to one point. Uh, is there any prize I can win? What, what is there at stake? Uh, I don't know yet. I, 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 but there is something for me to win. Like it's like you can get ho- honor, Carol. The honor. Uh, oh, oh well, I guess like honor can be good as well. Like, imagine if I got every single one of them right. Yeah, imagine that. Like, well, let's start. <laughs> can you see? Oh gosh. Yeah, I can see. So, for our listeners, this is this is like a uh, like a on a plum background, like a. Uh, all the all like the backgrounds comment. are the same. I uh, use the same background for every. I chose pur- purple because I felt like it was a color that wasn't used a lot in the logo, so it was kind of good as a background in that way. Okay, so let me describe the logo. It's like a like it, it's like a like a football that someone ate out of on the left side and has like an orange underside. Okay. Do you have? It's. <laughs> what do you think? Like I don't know what. What is this supposed to be? It it literally looks like a, like a, like a piece of bread. So, do you want the clue? Uh, can I make a guess? Before okay, you that? can guess. You can tell me if it's yes. right or not. Okay, mm, New York Paneras. New York Paneras. No. 
I don't know. Give me the clue, okay. please. This, the team's animal-based name was inspired by a 1992 Disney film. So, That's an animal. Yes. Logo. I can tell you it's a foot of an animal. Okay, so it's something duck. Like ducks. Well, it's... you got one point r right there. And... I mean, ducks are everywhere. Why ducks? Like, uh, Carol, you have, get, you, Montana Carol, ducks. You have already get, got it ra right. Uh, the team name is Ducks. The, the, okay. What and you see you... here is a duck foot. <laughs> it looks like a chewed up. Yeah, I, I can be honest. This is, not prob this is probably not a, one of the best logos there is, but it is supposed to be a duck foot. And... Okay, next. One point. Yeah, one point, but uh, you haven't guessed uh, the city yet. I said Montana. Montana. Is, is that a city? Uh, maybe. Or a state? Uh, do you want to have the clue for a city? Yes, please. Uh, this city is located in the Los Angeles metropolitan er area in the United States, California. It's the most populated city in Orange County. Tent in California, the theme park Disneyland is located in this city. Oh my god, I've just watched a video about like Disney parks not not long ago. Where is the Disney park located? Well, it's in California, I can tell you that. So it's California Ducks? No, that California is a state. <laughs> <laughs> this is really putting me a blast with my geography knowledge. Um, okay, okay. So Disneyland, where are the where I can find the Disney parks? You can find them in Hong Kong and Singapore, in Paris, in. I don't think you're going to get uh, this one to be honest, because this one is kind of hard. Wait, 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 wait. Let me guess, because there's like on the other side of the street is the. Is the Hawks is uh, the Harry Potter world? Is uh... oh my god! I have it at the tip of my tongue. Uh, I don't remember. Can we move on because we have some more teams? Yeah, but what is the Anaheim. answer? Anaheim. I would have never. Yeah, I didn't. That. I I didn't Anaheim expect in a real it. City. This is kind of a hard first one. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I, I can tell you this, I have gone in alphabetical order of these teams and Anaheim Ducks came up first. Okay, well, please baby questions because I am just terrible at trivia in general. What that, what, what is this? It's like some kind of a, like a tribal fursona. It looks like a, like a fox that got like a skull? I don't know, skull foxes of, of, of Ontario? Um, no. Uh, I can give you a clue here. Uh, one part of the Looney Tunes animal duo where Wiley E. Blank tries to kill and eat the Coyotes. bird Roadrunner, Beep Beep, but the bird is too fast and wi Wiley always fails. Wiley E. Blank is the same animal as the team logo. Okay, so it's yes, a coyote. Yes, it's a coyote. And uh, do you know where coyotes are in the United States? Mm. I don't. I, As I said, I'm terrible with, with geography and uh, hockey. All I see is this orange coyote wearing red and green with some purple accents. What the hell? Where they can... Like, okay, coyotes, so they're like, uh, like... Do you want the... Planes, do you want the clue? Uh, steps. Texas coyotes? Uh, it's ice hockey in close Texas? to Texas, I can tell you that. Uh, the team name is from an American state. The state borders Mexico. The capital and the largest city in, in the state is the city named Phoenix. Ontario? <laughs> I don't... I think Ontario is Canada. 
I'm, sorry. I'm just going to tell the answer. It's uh, Arizona. Oh God. Okay. Well, Arizona. Who like? Do they really have coyotes? I I I guess so. Okay. So the next logo. It's it's a black circle with a big yellow B on it. Or it's either a circle, a wheel, or a basketball. Or like a like a, or like a ship uh, steering wheel. Yeah, kind of. I, I gotta say, it's kind of fun to hear your reaction of some of these logos. Like, how do you, how do you connect this to ice hockey? Why isn't like some some kind of like a cute penguin? Well, uh, like that actually, uh, wait, wait a second with that one. <laughs> because I know there is where we live. There is also, but that, that's a rugby team. Okay. Mm. Um. So, here's uh, a clue. Another word for brown oh. beer. A what? Now? Another word for brown beer. Beer as in no. you drink, or beer as in it m will more. Beer as off. the big animal. Cubs? No, I I I gotta be honest. I don't think you will get this one because this one is kind of hard, hard and it's. It's well, at least let me try. Okay, so black and yellow, yellow, black, black and yellow, black and yellow. Ooh, black and yellow. <laughs> um, I am. It it just makes me think of the B movie. It just makes me think of, of the B movie. Okay. Like I I don't know uh, Brooklyn City B. <laughs> that's that's kind of a good name to be honest. But uh, this is. Uh... This is Bruins, and for the city, what? the city clue is this: it's the most populated and largest city in the New England area. What the hell is a New England? <laughs> <laughs> it's an area over the New York <laughs> area. I, I am, I am so not targeted audience. I do not know. Like, I know pop stars. I know my Taylor Swift, but USA is a big bag of mystery to me, geographically speaking. Uh, okay, so like I know Brooklyn Brooklyn Bears. No, um, I can tell you the name now. Bronx uh, Bears. Boston Bruins. Ugh. Have you heard of Boston? I. <laughs> oh my god! I, I mean, I did. Yes. Okay, next I one. Did. Okay, so that's a bison. Uh, so yeah, it's, a... it's uh, another word for bison. I can give you correct for bison to be honest, but it's another word. What? Another world word for bison? Yeah. Jeez. I, 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 okay, I, so... I'm, go I'm going to actually gi give you this one because that one was kind of clo close. Uh, have you ever heard of the city Buffalo? Oh my god, yeah. Okay. Okay, so and, Buffalo Swords uh, or Sabres? Yes, that's correct. Buffalo Sabres. You have gotten four points, Carol. <laughs> Yay. Congratulations. <laughs> so for for our listeners, this is like a blue circle logo with a buffalo and two sabres. Yeah, it's kind of on point, right? Yeah, I mean, you look at it, you get... What the hell is this? <laughs> it's just a flaming sea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you have got one part of the correct. It's uh, flames. Yes. Okay, so like flaming cockatoos. What? What is cockatoo? It's like a little bird that that when when it lays eggs, it lays it in. Yeah, but like, you, you have already gotten bird. the team name right. You need a city name now. Is it really flaming cockatoos? No. <laughs> uh, I can tell you the uh, clue if you want for the city. Yeah. It, it's located in the Canadian province Alberta. Oh my god. Uh, I, I feel I should know this. I watched I, I watched How I Met Your Mother. How I Met Your Mother <laughs> is not in Can Canadian. Uh, in Canada. It's not, but Robin is, and she is into hockey oh, guys. Okay. I never seen How I Met Your Mother. <laughs> It's kind, of, it's kind of funny uh, okay. how all, all your facts come from how I met your mother.
<laughs> yeah, because as I said, I don't watch hockey. Even like, like I had a friend who watched hockey. Like, no, he didn't watch. He played hockey, but he was then injured and he couldn't play hockey anymore. Like something happened with his knee and he couldn't stand on uh, on skates anymore. Well, uh, should okay, I just... Uh, final guess? Okay, you can guess. Uh, it's gonna be... Uh, flaming Cougars. Uh, no, it's... Uh, Calgary Flames. Calgary Flames. So they're not all... I can, I can tell you that the based. CD name is always the part that comes first. Okay, next. And I gotta be honest, I don't really get this one either. Okay, so it's a vortex, or like a t hurricane. Oh my god, you got it. What? A it's a hurricane. It's like, yeah, so what I see is like a, like a spinny, like the logo looks like a spinny red, black and white Beyblade. But I know it's not a Beyblade, so it has to be a vortex or, a, or like a hurricane. Yeah, it is a hurricane. Now you get, a, you got to, uh, this is a name of a state in, in America. Okay, uh, hmm. Chicago Hurricanes, Washington Hurricanes. No, uh, I said state. That that's those are cities, or actually Washington. Uh, Washington, Washington is Washington a state. <laughs> this this is a, a state. Arkansas Hurricane. Canada is not a state. Arkansas <laughs> state. I don't know. What is this? Like, okay, yeah, gra hurricanes. graphics with the, the Media Bubble podcast. <laughs> uh, well, I can give <laughs> you the clue. Uh, two states have this name. There's a north and a south. Two other states. Carolina? Yes. Carolina Hurricanes. So, okay. So you got one point there. Didn't I get two if I got the name and the uh, and the state? Well, uh, you got three points there in uh, for the Carolina Hurricanes. Okay, so what I see in front of me is a, a Indian man with a headpiece. Yeah. Uh, it's red, yellow, green, and orange. Yeah. Uh, so it's. So it's like some something Indians, right? No, not really. Um, in some ways, yes, but uh, you're not. I'm, I don't think you're going to. You can guess <laughs> some cities if you want. Uh, Washington. No. I know. Already said this. Like, where are where can you find like nature reserves in the United States? This is this is hilarious because I know where like where is like the corn belt and the rust belt in the United States, but I don't know anything else. You have I can tell you this, you have mentioned this city before. I've mentioned a lot of cities. <laughs> okay. Uh, Do you want the clue? Yes please. It is the third largest city in the United States. There's also a famous mu musical with the same name as the city. I'm thinking musical with the same name as the city. And you have mentioned the, the name before. California? That's a state. <laughs> Miami? <laughs> no, I haven't mentioned Miami. Uh, it's not New York. No. Should I just tell you? Yes, please. Um, Chicago. Ah, oh my God, Chicago. For the team name, uh, the name was inspired by a Native American sock leader. Think of a color and a bird. What? Why? The Should I just okay, tell you the Chicago answer? Red Hawks. You got one part correct. Hawks is in the title. Black Hawks? Yes. Black Hawks. Chicago Black Hawks. Isn't like Red Hawks here in Sweden? <laughs> yes. Uh, I think so. Maybe that's why I got them confused. Well, here's the okay. next logo. Yeah. So from what I see, it's 
it's like an it's a letter. It's A and it's either a like a waterfall or like a hurricane hurricane again or like some kind of blizzard of Alberta blizzards? Yeah, that's a good name. Uh, but uh, it's not correct. Uh, can, if you think when you ski, uh, there can sometimes come, come these... Um, avalanche. Yes, avalanche. I technically gave you a clue there, but I gave you the two points anyway. <laughs> I think you, I think I deserve only one. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, the capital of the state uh, is uh, the city Denver. So the city where Denver is uh, located. No, the the state where Denver is located. Why are you doing this to me? <laughs> I don't know where Denver is. I don't know where anything is. Okay. Okay. I Google Maps on every single day of my life. <laughs> Colorado Avalanche. <laughs> okay, so what I see is a flat. It, I mean, it's it's a star. It's it's a five point star with a flag flying in from behind towards the viewer. Maybe I should. Um, maybe we should change this. Maybe it's Carol's reac reaction to NHL logos. Well, <laughs> I mean, the viewer, the listeners have to somehow get what we're what we're seeing. Mm. But I mean, what is this? So like Texas stars or uh, Puerto Rico? Do you want to know a weird point? There actually is an uh, an hockey team which is called Texas Stars. It's not in this uh, quiz, but uh, there actually is a I mean, hockey team with that name. There, that doesn't help me much. This is about points. <laughs> uh, do, okay, do you want so a clue? What, what? Yes, please. A color, a color, and a clothing item. You. Uh, so it's a uh, clothing item. It's a color. The name is a color and a clothing item you put on when you go out. So when you move outside, you put on this clothing item. Star Spangled Jackets? Blue Jackets? Yes, Blue Jackets. You got the name I mean, correct. This the logo and the name is so... Like, the, the, the economy, like, it doesn't tell me at all that this is, like, anything blue or jacket. Okay, and the clue I have for the city, uh, the city was named uh, was named for explorer Christopher Blank. Columbus. Yes. So Colum so blue Columbus Columbus's blue jackets. Yes, Columbus blue jackets. Now this is just lazy 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 design. <laughs> this is something yeah, you're, you would see, you're correct there. This is something you would see like on a gamer merch. Uh, yeah. So what I see again is a star, five point star, with a green outline and a D in the middle of it. Yeah, that's exactly what this is. So Dallas green jackets. <laughs> no, uh, you have got the city correct, but. Uh... What, what is the outline, Carol, again? It's green. No, but the shape. It's a star. Yes, connect. Dal Dallas green stars? Dallas stars. But, I mean, why not? Like, Dallas cowboys, like, makes sense, I suppose. Okay. So what I see in front of me is a white and red wheel with wings. And it looks real pretty. It looks something like you would see on a Harley. Uh, mm. uh, I can I can tell you this. You have already said uh, parts of the name. Uh, think of the, the color and uh, what, what's on the wheel. So, white wings? 
Um, close, the Red other wings. color. Red wings, yes. Okay. And where are you supposed to be from? Like, it's a wheel. Wheel. Okay, where do wheels originate from? Um, America, I suppose. <laughs> where in America? Well, uh, it's a well the, this secret. city is kind of known for uh, their uh, cars, you can say. Oh my god, it's the one that's falling apart. Um, yes, correctly. Detroit. Detroit yes. uh, Red Wings. Detroit Red Wings. <laughs> this is one of the most more famous hockey teams, actually. Really? Yeah, yeah you, you, you could probably see someone wear this logo on their caps or something like that. It's very fashionable. Like, I could imagine myself wearing this on a t-shirt. Hmm. Okay, so what I see in front of me is a white circle with a blue, like, navy outline, and it's Oilers. Uh, in the well, middle. we got the name correct. <laughs> Very hard, I know. <laughs> so, Oilers. I don't know, mm. New York City Oilers. No, uh, this is in Canada. Oh, it's in Canada, okay. What other Canadian cities do I know? Toronto Oilers. Nope. Alberta Oilers. Uh, well, uh, the city is in Alberta. I'm getting closer. Okay. What is Alberta anyway? <laughs> <laughs> what is Alberta? <laughs> what is Alberta? <laughs> like, I don't know. It's, I guess, like, what is in Alberta more exactly? Well, uh, we had one city in Alberta, which was Calgary. Yeah. So Calgary Oilers? No. Calgary doesn't have two teams. That sucks. Is it like, where can you find like cities with two teams? Um, well, there are uh, two uh, coming up. Uh, there are some coming up. Okay. I can tell you that. Okay, so um, they do exist. Yes. I, I'm, I'm gonna have to give up. Like, uh, It starts with an E. E. Okay, I'm just going to tell you Edmonton. I'm glad it exists, Edmonton. <laughs> to all I never heard of Edmonton, it before. To, to all our listeners in Edmonton, your biggest fan here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all our listeners from Edmonton. Okay, so this is F Florida Cougars. Or Panthers. Oh, what did you say? Florida, Florida Panthers. Cougars. Yes, that's... You got four points there. Thank Florida you. Panthers. Like, on point, straight, like, you get what this is. Los Angeles Kings. Yes, four points. Even the logo looks like ass. <laughs> so this is something like Wolves or Wolverines. No, it's actually not the name of an animal. Yetis? No, uh... Bigfoots. I said it's not the name of an animal. Bigfoot is not an animal, he's my husband. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Is, is I, your, uh, uh, do you live a happily life with Bigfoot? Uh, it, I, you know, there is a saying like, if you love someone, you should let them free, and if they come, if they, if they love you, they come. He didn't have them come back. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I am. I'm, <laughs> I'm on the point of breaking. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm going to give you the clue now. Uh, in the forest, there can be wild animals. The answer is somewhere in that sentence. You have one guess. So, wild or...? Right, you got it correct. Wild. But what is like... Okay, so the logo is some kind of like a creature, angry one, and its eyes is a five-pointed star. There's also like a... Like, like a setting sun situation behind the trees. Mm. Where can this um, be? Like a lot of USA is already covered in forests. Do you want the, the state clue? Montana Wilds? No. No uh, idea. This state is known for having a lot of Scandinavian I immigrants. Or at least it's known here for the state that has a oh lot of God. Scandinavian. Where is Marshall from? I know I'm bringing this back to how I met your mother, but there was a point. Like, I've actually looked it up. Uh, Wisconsin Wilds? 
No. It's Ash. it's above New York. I know that. It's like almost uh, like neighboring with Canada, I think. Yeah. Uh, do you do you want to hear it? Let me think. Let me think. Maybe I'll know. Uh, nope. My mind is Mi blank. What is the answer? <laughs> Minnesota. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> because because Marshall is from Minnesota. That that's like a lot of the jokes come from that. You see. God damn it. Okay. Yeah. It's a C. Uh, it looks like it looks like uh, Falukorv. Yeah, yeah. Do you want to hear what this logo sometimes is called for? What is it? The toilet seat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it does look like that. So it's a red toilet seat with an H in the middle. <laughs> okay. Like, what is this? Like... Uh, do you want to hear uh, the... Hamburg sausages? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, um, I'm going to tell you the clues. Yeah. Uh, the country above is... Wait, what have I written here? The country above USA. Canada. Yes, that's correct. That's the team name. What? Why? I mean, Canada has its own teams. Why is this like Canada? Like, why did they hog all the glory? I don't really know why. It's This team is like the first NHL team. And I guess they weren't so creative back then. Yeah, I mean, look at their logo. Okay, so Canada yeah. H. What does H stand for? Water. No. I can tell you that the H is not going to help you. <laughs> so why is it in the logo? I actually don't know. But uh, it's the second largest city in Canada. Canada... Canada's... Wait. Ontario's Canada's? Toronto's Canada's? No. No. Should I just tell you? Sure. Montreal. Montreal. That's where EA Studios is located. Yay. That that's that's a uh, fact I know, but I, not actually, where it is. When I say the cities, you always come with some facts of them. Like I know that they exist, but I'm not connecting that they are probably in Canada. <laughs> They're like their own entities. Hmm. Okay, so this is like saber tooth. I see before me a white saber tooth with some blue details. Yeah. Um, it's not the animal itself. It's more what it represents. Teeth. Good dental. No. Uh, I'm just going to give you the clue. Actually, uh, it's not the prey. It's the. It's the what? It's not the prey, it's the... Eat, laugh, love? What? Predator. What? L like I didn't know how to give you a better clue than, uh, than that, to be honest. You could have said like, a t the titular bad guy from the, from the, f from the series, uh, hmm <laughs> alien versus hmm <laughs> Yeah, that may be you. <laughs> I, I I tried to think a way I could read them so we, it would be connected to the movie, but I didn't come up with one. Because I, I, I thought you said pray as in like pray at church. And I was like, what oh. does this have to do with anything? <laughs> <laughs> pray for the white tiger. Yeah, so Colombia white tigers. No, uh, this city is known for its music, especially the game genre country I listen to some country I live like in the middle of the field so I should at least have some osmosis os osmosis some knowledge about this um, Kentucky predators no uh, should I just tell you go ahead Nashville predators why do you call yourself predators? Don't you think it's a little bit like, 
Mm, problematic. Mm. You want to hear a fact about this team? Go ahead. This is the team that I uh, that I share for. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean anything I said <laughs> just five <laughs> few minutes ago. <laughs> It's, it's a really you take cool all team. that back. <laughs> okay. Okay, so this is like some kind of devil. Yes, that's uh, you have gotten two points right there. So what I see is like a black circle logo with white, uh, like center, and in the middle is like a simplified simplified devil, uh, and it's also an, in the shape of an N. Um, Nevada Devils? No. Uh, de you see the shape of an N, but there's another letter also sh sh shaped. New York Devils. Close. My, I'm, I'm, my gears are turning. What other cities are there b b besides N? This is New not Jersey a city, Devils. it's a... Yes! Correctly. Four points, Carol. Thank you. <laughs> You did it! I'm st are you proud of me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> New York City Islanders. <laughs> Four points. Thank you. <laughs> it was very simple seeing that it's in the name. New York City Rangers. <laughs> <laughs> Four points again. <laughs> I'm on a roll. <laughs> <laughs> so what you like what in this quick su succession just like all the logos have names on them yeah so this is like a okay so what I see is like some kind of a Roman figure with a red hat yeah centurion centurions yeah 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 two points right there that's this um, that's the name of the team uh... Uh, I can give you the clue because. Uh, yes, please. Yeah. I don't see the, any the clues. Ca the capital from. of Canada. I. <laughs> okay, what is the capital of Canada? I, I. The funniest thing is, I said it multiple, multiple times throughout this episode. I'm not sure if you have say, said the, this uh, multiple times. Uh. The capital is, is not the same as the largest city. Where is Scott Pilgrim taking place? Isn't that Toronto? Yeah, so Toronto Centurions? No. God damn it. Uh, I can just tell you, it's Ottawa. Jeez. Actually, you, you once upon a time showed me an NHL lo logo and, the, and it was of this team. Did I? Yeah, you had some kind of... Uh, oh, yeah. I, oh, my God. I do. I have a bookmark with this logo. Now yeah. that I think about it. Yeah, because I got it from the rift, uh, from the gift exchange. And I even know that they have, like, a Swedish captain on their team. Uh, they had. Not they, anymore. Oh, boo. Well, the more you know. <laughs> no clue. What the hell is this? It's like, it's like someone tried to to make a hand, and then forget forgot how humans look. <laughs> what the hell is this? It's like so. It's like a, like like it's like a, it's like a winged O with a red s circle in the middle. Mm. Uh, I I'm just going to give you the clues. You're up in the air with a plane. What are you doing? Flying. Yes, that's uh, one point right there, Cal. I'm sleeping. <laughs> and the other clue is, think about cheese. What? Okay, a dumber. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm just going to tell you, uh, Philadelphia. Oh my god, well, I mean, it's Philadelphia, okay, Philadelphia, but it's more like a, it's like a cheesy spread. Like when I think yeah, of cheese, of. I think like those big blocks of cheese we have we have at other stores. Some sometimes I was nice with the clues, sometimes I was just mean. Yeah, I mean this was kind of like this was nicer, I think. Not like, oh, the capital of Canada. <laughs> <laughs> like, was I not nice there, Carol? 
How did I pass geography? Well, we're not to teach the American geography. We are to teach maybe European. I mean, yeah, I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go with that. Okay. So. <laughs> okay. In in front of me, I see on a <laughs> on a yellow triangle a buff penguin with skates. So it's penguins. Yes, um, penguins. Two points there. So where are they from? Uh, okay, so it has to like from what I've learned, it, it has to like have some panache, some like there's there's some method to naming the uh, to naming the teams. So Ottawa Centurions, Texas Stars. <laughs> I'm trying to game the system. Okay, so penguins, two syllables. New York Penguins. There's already been two New York teams. It needs more. Uh, okay. Uh, California just, Penguins. I'm going to give you a clue, but I, I don't think this clue will help very much, but the city is known as the Steel City. This is really making me look like a fool. I said like Rust Belt. <laughs> <laughs> and corn belt. I, I don't I, I don't expect you to get this one to be honest. Okay, so what cities are like located on the Rust Belt? I can tell you it's the same state as uh, Philadelphia. Well too bad I don't know where Philadelphia Okay, can you give me the answer please? Pittsburgh. Oh my god. Pittsburgh penguins makes sense, PP. The peepees. Peepee. The peepees. Peepee <laughs> poo poo. And in tonight's game, the peepees is taking on. The sharks. So Santa Maria sharks. I don't know. You're kind of close there actually, but it's uh, the sharks. Uh, that's two points. <laughs> I mean, the logo is just straight up a shark biting yeah. into a uh, hockey. Uh, do you want to uh, get, have the clue? Los Angeles sharks? You're kind of close, actually. Uh, but geographically or name-wise, like mm, Los... Uh, geographically, uh, you're kind of close. Where is Los Angeles, anyway? California Sharks? Uh, no. I'm stumped. The city is located in California. It's not San Francisco, it's San... Antonio? No. San Marino? <laughs> no. San Marino is a country in Europe, Carol. <laughs> I mean, it's not only like American and like North American teams we're talking about. Okay. Uh, I, I'm just going to tell you um, San Jose. Oh god. Why do they have a shark as their logo? Maybe there's sharks there. I mean, yeah, I guess. And this is just yeah. an S. Yeah, this this is the newest um, team actually in the National Hockey League. It's uh, a team that comes in uh, this season. Okay, so it's like a really stylized S, but I think it also has something to do with octopuses. It's uh, it's like minty or like muted mm. bluish with a red eye. You're correct with the octopus so it's octopus it's, part, it's a but kraken. yeah, it's a kraken. Uh, you actually got that one. Uh, two yeah. points right there. Yeah, you can see like the ridges on the S. Um, yeah. So who would have Kraken as their logo? Like it's it's badass. I mean, I can't say California Krakens again. I'm just saying California all the time. California. Massachusetts Krakens. No, I'm going to give you the clue. Please. Uh, the TV shows Grey's Anatomy, iCarly, and Frasier all takes place in this city. Oh my... F I know this! I just watched uh, a documentary about iCarly. It's like four hours long. <laughs> no. What Carol does on his free time. I mean, it's, it's a part of the series, so there is like a, like, there is like a big series retrospective. Uh, uh, so the guy... 
made first a three hour episode recapping the first three seasons and then topped it off with a four hour rest of the series <laughs> retrospective and he's not done because he's also gonna do like the sister shows okay oh my god well it starts with an s as you can see in the logo here i know uh... seattle Crackens. yes Seattle Krakens. Yes, because there was a tidbit where, the, when, when, uh, like Quentin reviews, he's asking like, how do they get money to live in this spacious three-story apartment in like 2008 in Seattle? Mm. <laughs> what the heck is, What the hell is this? Um, it's a music note. Yeah, so it's a blue music note with wings. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it more looks more like a label instead of a music note. Mm, yeah. The name is a genre of music. Uh, Houston Pops. Um, think about the, Jazz. the color, color here. Think about the color. So, you like jazz? <laughs> no. Think uh, about the color that you see in the logo. It's blues. Yes. Uh, I can give you one point there. Um, uh, the city biggest landmark is the Gateway Arch. It just makes me think of France. Like Arch de Triomphe. Gateway Arch. Chicago Blues? No. Uh, I'm just going to tell you the name because I don't think you're going to get this. Um, St. Louis. Oh god, who who cares about St. Louis? Like, <laughs> to all our listeners in St. Louis. <laughs> Nothing personnel. <laughs> <laughs> who cares about St. Louis to all our listeners? Okay, so I see a circle logo with a uh, see-through inside and it's a bolt. So lightning bolts, bolts, electricians. Uh, lightning, uh, two points. Okay, so. Uh, the cool. city is located in the state of Florida. Can they just be Florida lightnings? No. Wait, weren't They're... you like on a vac vacation in Florida once? Me, no. No, no be because I know you went once with your parents, I think. I've never been to the US. I have a vague memory of you telling me that you were once. No. God damn it. Okay, well, that there goes my way of fishing out the information. Um, well, anyway, I think I should just tell you that the name of the city. What is the city? Tampa. Tampa Bay. Uh, Tampa Bay Lightnings. It, it has a good, like, rhythm to it. Okay. It looks like a, something you would find on a package of, like, uh, baking powder. <laughs> <laughs> One of the most fam famous logos in, in the NHL, and <laughs> that's what you say to it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, it does look like a little sign, like, oh, it's ethically produced, but it's mm. Toronto maple leaves, and it's a blue leaf. Well, you got four points right there. More of these, please. Uh, so that's an orca. That's a what? An orca. You know, okay. the, the, the blue, the, the blue, the big, like, white and black uh, sea mammals that eat uh, otters and penguins. Yeah, but the, it's that called an orca. Uh, killer whales. Yeah, killer whales is the name I'm more for familiar with. So what is it's it, and it also makes a C. So something killer whales. C C C C California killer whales. Do you want to know something? The logo has absolutely nothing to do with the name. What? Okay, so why bother with a logo in the first place? Um. You can write them a letter. 
<laughs> Dear yeah. sirs, I have never ever ever watched any of your games and I don't even know why you actually exist. But your logo bothers me tremendously. Change it. Yeah. You're okay. faithfully the host of Bubble Media Podcast, Carol. <laughs> Ooh, the Bubble the Bubble Media Podcast has emailed us. Exactly, like we have to change it. <laughs> mm. I have no um, idea. I uh, yeah, um the, these clues are not uh, that good either, I can tell you. A slang a slang term for Canadian. <laughs> I'm just going to tell you Canucks. I would have never guessed that. No, I don't think you would have either, that's why I t- told you. Uh, the city, a major city in Western Canada, located in the lower mainland region of British Columbia. Maine. No, Vancouver. Vancouver Canucks. I. This 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 is this looks like a uh, Transformers logo. Yeah, now that you say it, it kind of does. <laughs> So, what I see before me is a gold, white, and black Roman helmet. Uh, so, Romans? No. Soldiers. Uh, gladiators. No. It's just an ordinary... Um, uh, think medieval... Uh... Knights. Yes. Knights. Uh, the funny thing get, is, I, you you could have just put like any fake team you could have imagined, and you, I would be totally convinced that it's real. Mm. The, this is called the uh, Golden Knights. Okay. Uh, and it's in. Uh, uh, do you see the shape of the helmet? Yeah. It's shaped like a letter. M. No. V. Yes. Viva Las, Viva Las, <laughs> Viva Las Vermont. <laughs> Viva Las La- Vermont. <laughs> so it's uh, Las Vegas Golden Knights. Yes, uh, yes. Okay. <laughs> Viva Las Vermont. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so if I can read the, the red text on the purple background, um, Washington Capitals. You got four points. Thank you. I Do you want to it. hear the clues for this one? <laughs> you wrote clues. <laughs> Go ahead. Yeah. These are the clues I, I had written. Read it. <laughs> and if you were going to ask again, I would uh, have answered. Read it again. <laughs> I mean, those are my two clues. <laughs> good clues, good clues. But at the same time, I have to judge it because, like, mm. at least like Toronto Maple Leafs, it looks like a Maple Leaf. They just they kind of gave up. Yeah, uh, this is the last logo. Okay, so what I see before me is like something you would find on a dishwasher, like the little knob to turn the temperature, with a little plate in the middle. <laughs> Uh, what the hell is this? Like, it's a, is that a maple leaf? Can I? Is it Canadian or is it, it's Canadian, right? It's Canadian. Okay, so Canada. What? It's what did Canada do? Um, <laughs> uh, I have no idea. Like. Ottawa airplanes or jets? Uh, yes, uh, yes is uh, is correct actually there. Okay, so uh. Uh, Alberta jets. You're uh, you're not that far. Um, uh, the city I'm name. <laughs> uh, in in this clue, I just gave up. The city name is. Uh, the city is named after the nearby Lake Winnipeg. 
<laughs> you have a guess? <laughs> hmm. So, Winnipeg Jets. Yes. And uh, that's the last logo. And you, your score is uh, 77 points. Out of how much? I don't know really out of how much, but uh, uh, you got 77, Carol. Well, it's not the worst, I think. I feel like I tried my best. And even though I have, I know none of these teams, I had, I have fun. Yeah, yeah. I gotta say this, this kind of was fun, fun even. To, your, your unknowing was kind of uh, fun, I gotta say. But we're going to end this episode here. So, um, as always, thank you for listening, and we hope you enjoyed it as much as we have. Don't forget to follow, hit that bell icon. Or follow us on social medias like Twitter. And we also like... So, see you again in the next episode. And have a wonderful day. Have a wonderful day. Bye.